Like many other sectors, Zimbabwe's film industry has suffered from a decade-long financial crisis. Actors have had little choice but to look for opportunities elsewhere, except for a hopeful few who believe Zimbabwe's film industry is destined for a significant turnaround. We've seen a, a, a willingness to come out of our shells, to make do with whatever we have, to make productions, because that's the only way we'll be self-sustaining. We also need to educate our, our audience. Local filmmaker Patience Tawengwa believes that it is possible to create a sustainable film sector in Zimbabwe, and she started her own production company to prove it. I think a lot of our artists uh, suffer the indignity of um, unemployment and not being able to take care of themselves. And it's not for lack of having skills or talent because they were born with that God-given skill of being an artist and that's the way that they're meant to make a living. So Malele's drive is really to create productions uh, which are going to be profitable. <laughs> Nothing has breathed life into Zimbabwe's film industry quite like the Zimbabwe International Film Festival. It's a key event, affording local filmmakers a platform to showcase their skills while attracting broader support for Zimbabwean productions. The festival will be running. It's, 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 a, it's a cocktail of film screenings. You have top of the range, some of your internationally acclaimed films and the filmmakers all will be here. We are getting to a stage where perhaps in a few years, not so far from now, the festival will be opened by a local film. While Zimbabwe's film industry is yet to compete with the likes of Nigeria's Nollywood, it's hoped the efforts of a new generation of filmmakers will be the key to success in the future. Lindim Tongana, CCTV.